And frustrations with one of their own reached a boiling point on the Senate floor as several Republican senators challenged Tommy Tuberville over his blockade of more than 370 military promotions and nominations. Tuberville's fellow GOP senators argued there are major national security implications to Tuberville's hold, which has lasted more than eight months and is in the protest over the Pentagon's abortion policy. ABC's M. Wynn has you covered. After several months of gridlock where very few military promotions or nominations have been allowed to proceed because of the actions of one U.S. senator, anger from his fellow Republican senators spilling onto the Senate floor. Frustrated Republicans challenging Alabama Senator Tommy Tuberville's blockade of more than 370 military nominations and promotions. But why are we putting holes on war heroes? No matter where you believe it or not, Senator Tuberville, this is doing great damage to our military. One by one, GOP senators led by Alaska's Dan Sullivan, a colonel in the Marine Corps Reserve, read a list of 61 nominations out loud. And despite these promotions typically being one of the most bipartisan actions in the Senate, one by one, Tuberville rejected them. Tuberville's decision to block the advancement of military careers is in protest of the Pentagon's controversial policy, which covers the costs for troops who are stationed in states that restrict access to abortions, allowing them to travel to states where they can legally obtain the procedure. I cannot simply sit idly by while the Biden administration injects politics in our military, again, injects politics in our military from the White House and spends taxpayers' dollars on abortion. But in the wake of the escalating conflict in the Middle East and after the Marine Corps Commandant was hospitalized after a medical emergency, frustrations boiled over. Xi Jinping is watching this right now. He's loving this. So is Putin. GOP senators argued Tuberville's hold harms military readiness and punishes officers whose promotions have already been approved and have no role in the Pentagon's policy. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer is pressing forward with a new resolution that, if passed, could circumvent Tuberville's halt, temporarily allowing all nominations to be voted on all at once. M. Wynn, ABC News, Washington.